Well, no way I'd ever have guessed the world tree was like this on the inside. It definitely appears to be man-made. Created by the same civilization as Moritha. The birthplace of the architect. That's what Jin called it. Then maybe the architect built this thing. Do you really think we're going to find him at the top? And Elysium too? From what we saw in Moritha, it seemed like all that stuff happened a gazillion years ago. Or maybe two gazillion. I don't know. Not even Titans live that long. Even Pyra and Mithra have never actually met him. But this tower's right here. It's real. So... Seeing is believing, is the phrase. Hmm? We'll just have to find out for ourselves. There's no use speculating. Nia, what's wrong? His tummy started rumbling. Oh, Father... Every time with you, it's, have you lost your wallet, or are you hungry? Is that really all you can think of? Meh. Tora thought food is only thing that makes Nia all, um, growly growly. Watch it, Furball. What is Nia's problem? That's not a nice way to ask, Poppy. But I let it slide. There's something I want to ask you, Blades. Tell the truth. Have you ever wanted to extend your life? Avoid returning to our cores? Yeah. That's a tough question. I would like to keep learning about my former selves, but to keep living after Morag is dead... Oh, I'm sorry. No, I understand. <sighs> the idea of living on without her does not appeal to me. Yeah, same here. I want my memories of the Prince to be just between us. You're going to make me blush, Pandy. Jomak? As long as I'm by my lady's side till the end, then I'm satisfied. Poppy is artificial blade, so it is very sad for me to think about. When Master Pawn is gone, Poppy will be widow. Well, not quite, but I get where you're coming from. Pyra? Well, I... It's different for you, right? You've been alive for a few centuries. Did I ask you? Pyra, what do you think about it? Really? Hey. Sometimes... I wonder why I have to keep on living forever. Just on and on, no end in sight. But it's different now. I'm glad I've stayed alive all this time. Parting is always sad. But it's just part of the deal of being me. Though, maybe. Maybe one day I'd be happy to close my eyes forever. With someone special. There. By my side. Pyra. That's so, Pyra. Thanks, guys. Thanks for sharing with me. So, what made you ask? I'm a flesh eater. So... I don't know how long I'll live for. I mean, for all I know, I might just sniff it tomorrow. My lady. But I can say this much. My life and death isn't tied to any human. And? It's Jin. I've been wondering. Jin was collecting core crystals. But why didn't he use them? Doesn't he hate humans? He could use them to create blades, then turn them into flesh eaters. He could expand Torna with no need for humans in the mix. They do lack numbers. Is that all of them? Yeah. It's just the five of them. That's it. When Malos suggested getting Obrona and Akos to resonate, Jin was dead against it. 
So I think maybe... Maybe Jin fears the same way as us. The same way as us? I think maybe that's why he won't resonate with anyone. 